Thanks for joining me today at InvestorIdeas.com Clean Tech and Climate Change Podcast, looking at today's problems and solutions for the future. I'm your host, Don Van Zandt, founder of InvestorIdeas.com, and hoping to share our way of making a difference in climate change. Good morning and welcome to the Clean Tech and Climate Change Podcast. EV stocks are on investors' alerts again due to big news from Canoe trading on the NASDAQ, GOEV. The stock traded as high as $5 today on huge volume and led other EV stocks higher, uh, with NEO trading as high as $21.19. None of the uh, EV stocks are anywhere near their 52-week high, but in this market, investors are very happy to see any green again. Walmart, trading on the NYSE, WMT, signed an agreement with Canoe, uh, a high-tech mobility company, to purchase 4500 all electric delivery vehicles, beginning with the lifestyle delivery vehicle known as LDV, with the option to purchase up to 10,000 units. The vehicles will be used to deliver online orders in a sustainable way, which will also contribute to Walmart's goal to achieve zero emissions by 2040. While the LDV is expected to begin hitting the road in 2023, the company's plan to kick off advanced deliveries to refine and finalize vehicle configuration in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex in the coming weeks. Canoe's fully electric lifestyle delivery vehicle is an American-made commercial EV optimized for sustainable last-mile delivery use cases. As with all Canoe vehicles, LDV is built on a proprietary multi-purpose platform architecture that integrates the motors, battery, module, and other critical driving components. The LDV has a last mile delivery optimized cabin and customized cargo space. Canoe is utilizing true steer by wire technology, reducing moving parts and cabin intrusion, resulting in more usable interior space, better driver ergonomics, and the addition of a panoramic view to improve road visibility. The LDV is engineered for high frequency stop and go deliveries and speedy vehicles to drop to -to door-to-door drop-off, including grocery, food, meal delivery. Its customized interior is designed for small package delivery at competitive per-stock economics. The module design and 120 cubic feet cargo volume are adaptable to evolve with customer needs, which contribute to a decreasing per-unit investment over time. Canoe's electric vehicles will be driven by Walmart Associates and used to deliver online orders from groceries to general merchandise, as well as the potential to be used for Walmart Go Local, the retailer's delivery as a service business. So that's great to see EV stocks on the move again. It's been been up and down for so long. I think investors were starting to lose faith, so it's nice to see one really pop today. Uh, trading is up 79% at the time of this podcast, and again, a high of $5 today. So great news for investors in the sector, and hopefully we'll see more to come. That's it for today. Do something great for this beautiful planet each and every day. To hear more clean tech podcasts, visit the Clean Tech and Climate Change page on Investor Ideas. You can find it on our top template. Also, Investor Ideas has a lineup of other podcasts and themes, including the AII, the Crypto Corner, our cannabis podcast called Cannabis News and Stocks on the Move, rated one of the top investor podcasts in the sector, Play by Play, a podcast looking at sports and esports news, and Exploring Mining. To listen to any of our podcasts, visit our podcast page on Investor Ideas at InvestorIdeas.com forward slash audio. And a reminder, you can hear our podcasts on Spotify, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio, Google Play Music, and most audio platforms available to you. If you like any of our podcasts, we would appreciate you recommending them or reviewing them on your audio platform. And to help you follow and track clean tech and renewable energy stocks, Investor Ideas has created a directory of publicly traded stocks in the sector. You can find that by going to our homepage, looking on the sidebar and looking at renewable energy and environmental themes, and you'll find our stock directories there. Investor Ideas does remind all of investors to read our disclaimers and disclosures on our site. You can find them at InvestorIdeas.com forward slash about disclaimer dot ASP. It is important to read these. And this podcast is not an endorsement to buy products or services or securities. Investors are reminded that all investment involves risk and a possible loss of investment. Thank you again and have a great day.